channel youtube world and the people's channel good afternoon hot day in florida and a little muggy today i'm making this video showing some of my birds some of them some of these guys got youngsters so they're feeding i'm just showing some of them i'm just showing some of the birds here and there's a reason why i'm showing some of these birds it's the only reason why i'm showing it is for a reason to get a point through what I'm about to talk about, okay? Just some of them. Now, you think by any chance that I would jeopardize the life of any of my birds by putting them on the boxes that I use? Think about it, okay? And on this side, a few of some of these guys. These are few, few of some of my birds on this side. Okay? These are just a few of them. Just think about it. You think I would jeopardize the life of these birds by putting them in the box that I use. I'm using this because I'm gonna talk about the boxes, okay? Think about it, all right? Look at these birds and just think about it. You tell me if someone would do something like this, like this guy claims, okay? Now, you think that I would put my birds on a box that's not safe for them. You think I would put my birds on a box that when I take them every time to the post office, they told me, Abraham, you're good to go. Let me tell you something. Like I said, I've been shipping birds for a decade in a couple of years. If you don't know what's a decade, that's 10 years plus more. Okay? I ship my birds in three different locations. Okay? And every place I go, my boxes are safe to go. So when I hear someone come out with some nonsense, because they want to get their silly, silly message through. And they have to put me in their conversation and in their video so they can get a lot of subscribers and they can get a lot of people coming into their channel, which they have their own fan base. They have their own fan base, but they have to bring me in. They have to bring me in their videos so more people could come in the videos and they want to make them like they are, okay? And I will continue in just a while. YouTube world, here we go with the conversation. Okay, Rafi, I'm mentioning his name, Rafi. He made a video. The video was looking good as he started, but he messed it up when he brought me into his video. There was no reason for that. But I guess that's how he gets attention, making silly videos, okay? They talking about these boxes right here. Listen, I've been shipping these boxes every size, every single size. Red Eye is a witness. He came out with the second video because I bought a box from him for 20 birds. Now, when was the last time you shipped 20 birds, Rafi or Red Eye, okay? And the guy paid... $405 for the shipping, okay? I tried to talk the guy into not buying my birds because it was too much money. Not counting the box and the birds. And I told the guy, I will help you out in New York City and I will hook you up with some people that got good birds. He says, no, I don't want nobody's birds. I want your birds. I said, okay, no problem. Okay? This box right here, I was gonna ship five birds in that box right there for your information. 
Now I'm going to teach you guys a couple of things. Okay? They were charging me $150 for this box right here with five birds. The lady in the post office said, Abraham, that's too much money. So you know what? Come back with another box. Then that's when I started coming with these lovely boxes. They are 100% secure. Filters everywhere. Filters everywhere. Filters everywhere. Everywhere. Filters. 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 So next time you start talking nonsense, educate yourself. Okay? Because you're not teaching anybody anything. People already know that. You're probably teaching it to yourself. You started nice till you started bringing me into your video. Okay? So now I'm going to prove you wrong. You say, oh. He's always using tape. These tapes are heavy duty, the ones I use. And they're better than this nonsense that you was using. See this nonsense that you use? See this? I don't need to do this, and I don't like to do this. I like the tape. You see that? See that? You see that? Okay? These boxes are the way to go. And I'm telling everybody on YouTube, I'm promoting these boxes. You see what it says here? Huh? You see that? You see that? You see that? Okay. And you see this right here? That proves that there's live animals in there. You see that? And you see that? And they're not paying me for advertising these boxes, okay? So you two were on the People's Channel. This box right here, six birds, they would charge me $165 for six birds. No. This box right here, I made a mistake, would charge me $65 to $70, okay, for six bursts. This one right here, for five bursts, right here, would charge me $160 to $65, okay? This box right here is beautiful. Two bursts, one bird. When you ship one bird or two bursts here, you'll be paying the most. The most you'll be paying is probably $30. Depending where it's going. Now, this bird right here, you put two birds in there, you're going to end up paying about $100. This box, you can put five birds comfortable. This one, 201. This one, one to six comfortable. There's no danger on any of these boxes. And since I listen, I listen to the professionals. I don't listen to you guys talking nonsense. I listen to the post office. The three post office where I go, they said, it's good. You can use these boxes. Why should I listen to you? I should listen to the professionals. Okay? They told me, use these boxes, Abraham. They good, and they professional. And the birds will get there with no problem. Listen, I never had any problem shipping any birds on any of these boxes. Any problem. Okay? None. None. Okay? See what it says here? Animal life, pet shorter. Now, today I'm teaching you guys something. Because you started good, but you started wrong. Then the other guy came and followed you, red eye. Okay? These guys are newcomers. They say they're professional. They've been doing this for many years. It's a liar. Listen, I'm a pioneer of what I do. There is nothing that any of you two guys can teach me about pigeons. I don't want to sound too sarcastic. But I'm telling you the truth. I am telling you the truth. Maybe you could teach me, Rafi, about snakes. Because you like snakes and you got snakes. But you can't teach me nothing about pigeons. I taught you a lot about pigeons. A lot. We were friends. Remember when you went to my roof at 12 o'clock in the afternoon? And you left at 9 o'clock in the night. Because you didn't want to leave. Because you like everything you saw in my coop. Remember that. Okay? Red eye. Red eye. I tried everything with you, but you know what? You guys don't want to change. You guys are not into this for the sport. You guys are into this just to brag and to have people follow you on your nonsense. Well, anyway, that's what I got right now. You two world, thank you for watching my video. And if you don't want to watch you watch them, thank you for that too. It doesn't matter. Okay. So, till next time, don't listen to the noise that you hear from these people, because it's only noise. That's all it is. 
Continue to follow the hobby. Anyone that's interested in following the hobby, when you see these videos, block your mind. Don't listen to these videos because it's going to chase you away from coming into the hobby. It's a beautiful hobby. It got me out of a lot of trouble when I was young. It got me out of a lot of trouble. The gangs, the drugs, and everything else. This hobby got used it to keep me alive when I was growing up. I started with pigeons in the 70s. I'm not a newcomer. I'm a pioneer. Guillo and all those guys. I used to go to Guillo's roof and Straffa when he used to fly Danishes. I was a young kid. And all these other guys that know me, they know I'm telling you the truth. So you can make it look real nice to your, to your fan base. But the real people that know you, they know who you are. No matter what you do or no matter what you come out with. So you two are on the people's channel. I love you. Don't listen to the noise and the negative stuff that's going on on you too. Keep your mind positive and keep the hobby and continue the hobby. So everyone, God bless you. Have a great day. I love you guys all. Till then.